sister made um, a handwritten, well, partially handwritten calendar for me and for school so I can keep up with everything and it's pretty cool. Let me show you guys. She printed out the grids, but she wrote yeah. these. Yes. She's pretty. Yes. So, and I'm about to get my eyebrows done. Sister's gonna try to fill in my brows with um, Daiso product, and she got each one for like a dollar fifty. And this one is light brown, right? No, it's um, dark brown. The black one is dark brown. The other one's natural brown. Okay, so this is natural brown, and then this is um, the black one is uh, in shade dark brown, right? Okay, yeah. So this one is dark brown. Yeah. She used the dark brown on here without like cleaning it with like a concealer or whatever, but it looks decent. And it's light. And this one is natural brown, so it's lighter. What do you call these? Tacos dorados. Tacos dorados. Con... They're not burnt, they're crunchy. Too burnt. <laughs> I don't know, like things have been so weird lately and um, just wanted to sit down and chat with you guys for a little bit. Um, <coughs> the other day, um, somebody rear-ended me. Basically, um, after I exited from the freeway, it was a stoplight and so there was a car in front of me and then there was me and then for like a few seconds nobody was behind me I was just jamming to my music and just singing along as usual when I'm like by myself that's basically what I do um, and all of a sudden I just heard this loud bang and then I felt my car jerk and I was like what the fuck just happened and oh my god my fucking heart dropped like and I look at my rear view mirror and the car was literally like right behind me and I could not see the headlights. This has never happened to me before so yeah like it's a big deal and um, I've always like I always told myself like oh don't you know just drive safely you know all the time like no matter what because 
this happened to my sisters before and you know like I kind of learned from that even though it wasn't even though I didn't go through it like I kind of just learned from their you know not it wasn't their mistake but I just kind of learned from their experience and yeah like I never wanted to experience the same thing but things happen I guess the damage wasn't that bad um, so I pulled over and thankfully the car didn't drive away or anything um, he as well pulled over and you know I got all his information but thing is that he didn't speak English so it was really tough for me to communicate with him it wasn't his car I guess it was his friend's car so that made like the whole situation even more complicated the damage wasn't too bad I have a few dents um, on my rear bumper and yeah I don't have any injury or anything um, I just felt anxious for, like the whole entire night it was really hard for me to sleep but yeah I've already spoken to my insurance and it was raining pretty it was pretty slippery and maybe he just didn't stop on time I don't know what happened I don't know if he was on his phone and he did and he stepped on the brakes too late but thank God where everyone's okay I don't have any injuries or anything so yeah it's just things happen for a reason hello hello I just got home and it was raining so much after studying for a couple hours I stopped by the mall to grab a few things for my friends um, because we're finally celebrating Secret Santa or Christmas together um, yeah I know it's February but we always do this we always celebrate Christmas like two to three months after the actual Christmas day I'm so excited because I haven't seen them in a while and you guys will get to meet them so yeah Oh wow. Yeah. Oh so my god. Aww. Tony. Say hi. <laughs> hi. I'm so hungry, Tony. You've seen her before? <laughs> He's Kian Tiek. You've never seen him before? <laughs> you know how? Uh -huh. You've never seen him before? <laughs> So, juggling school and work at the same time has been bearable so far, and I was actually surprised. But yeah, so that's a good thing. Last night, um, I was about to go out or drive to Chris's house, but my car wouldn't start, so that's a bad thing. Um, it's not the battery or anything, it's not dead because my lights turned on, my radio turned on. So my dad called our family mechanic and he'll be here in about an hour or so to come look at my car. And I'm hoping it's nothing major because your girl is already stressing out about a lot of things and I cannot handle anymore. So yeah, um, I'm hoping for the best and I'm hoping I don't have to spend that much money but yeah, so that's pretty much it for now. Um, life has been good so far. Oh, and I dyed my hair black to black to black, back to black, because I was just tired of like looking at my hair or looking at my roots growing out so fast. So yeah, I just didn't want to stress about retouching my hair so freaking much because my hair grows so fast. I don't know why, but yeah it's a uh, blue black so in the light or in the natural lighting you can see a little bit of blue which i like because i love blue so yeah and i'll update you guys with my car and earlier i had to drop off my niece to school and of course 
I didn't have a car, so Chris let me borrow his. And yeah, for the meantime, I'm gonna be using his car in case I need to go anywhere. Um, yeah, so thank you. I love you. It's fixed. So the mechanic came like two hours later and um, I had to buy a new starter and I'm glad that it was just a starter, nothing else because that was already like a hundred and then an additional a hundred for his labor. But it's finally fixed, my car is running so yeah, and I couldn't really record anything because um, I parked my car out in the streets and of course I couldn't um, start my car and move it. <clears throat> so we were out in the rain for a good like 30 minutes. So yeah, I mean, it's fixed now. So that's all that matters. Hope it won't happen again. I don't really know how it broke. So I should look that up, but yeah, it was the starter, not the battery or anything, not the transmission, which I'm really thankful about because Chris was like, if it was the transmission, that's basically your whole car right there. Hello! What's today? Um, I think it's, it's the 24th, and we are going to Disney on Ice! It's my niece's first time, so yeah, pretty exciting. What did you think of the show? Tell them. Was it nice? Yeah. Would you like to see it again? Yeah. Which one was your favorite? Mimi Mouse. <laughs> you didn't like Ariel? I don't know. <laughs> Hello. So that's it for February. I know I wanted to do weekly vlogs, but school is kicking my butt right now, and so is work. I'm going to be doing monthly vlogs from now on because I feel like it's going to be much more easier for me. Month felt like years to me. I don't know what happened. It just felt so long and I can't wait for it to end because it's been so stressful. A lot of things happen with school and with 
you know, financial problems and everything. It's, ugh. but things are looking up kind of. So yeah, I just hope that, you know, March will be much better. I hope you guys enjoy my videos. And for those of you who watched and who is watching this right now, thank you for watching. Um, yeah, monthly vlogs will be coming and I'm planning to do more videos for you guys, not just vlogs. So yeah, just keep on the lookout. And again, thank you for watching!